Sacramento where five people, including a teen, were injured in a shooting. We heard police dispatch audio of the moments it was called in. Here it is. Each 415 in the street trying to figure out who's been shot. We have a total of five victims. Uh, one female, uh, the rest all male. Copy, one female, four males. Sorry, correction, two females. Copy, two females, three males. Police now trying to determine who opened fire. This is in the area of Coral Gables Court and Meadowview Road. KCRA 3's Leanne Denyer is live at the scene right now. She has been there for hours now gathering more information. So, Leanne, what's the latest? Well, thankfully, the latest update that we got from the Sacramento Police Department was that all five of those people are stable and expected to survive. But since we were last uh, last saw you guys at 1030 over on My 58, the difference is, is this tow truck has arrived. It does appear that they're getting ready to tow this silver sedan from the court here um, out of the area. This is the first time we've been able to get this close uh, to where police were investigating. I want to show you some videos video from earlier this evening. This call came in about eight o'clock tonight and there was a very large police presence um, in the immediate hours that followed. As of right now, there's only about three or four police officers, or excuse me, police patrol vehicles that are here. Um, but of course, a much larger scene earlier today. Police tell us they don't know what preceded this shooting. They don't know how these people knew each other. Um, but the last update that we did receive is that they are expected to physically be okay. We were able to get uh, a few words with a spokesperson for the department earlier. Take a listen. A very large complex and our, our big message is if that you saw something or you heard something to please let us know and help us find the individuals responsible for this. There was a lot of people that were involved in the shooting and we're not sure of all the facts and circumstances surrounding this incident and what led up to the shooting, but there are a lot of people that were injured in this and we need to make sure that they receive justice tonight. So I want to take you back out here live now as we are in this court. There is a little bit of action going on as some people are coming and going, and there are still a few officers uh, out here um, helping helping sort of facilitate this. Um, we, again, have heard that these five people, three males, two females, one of them, the, one of the females, a teenager, they are expected to be okay. They are stable. Uh, but at this point, the Sacramento Police Department tells us they do not have any suspect information. They are going to keep investigating. But for the most part, the crime scene tape has come down and they are, last of the police officers are wrapping up here for this evening. We're told that we'll get any updates uh, that they have as soon as they have them in Sacramento. Leon Denyer.